You're watching Adorama TV. Hi everybody, welcome to Adorama TV. I'm Mark Wallace. Well today we're going to be talking about the Flashpoint X-Series 2.4 GHz Remote Flash Trigger Kit. And that is the transmitter and receiver I have right here. Now this kit is uh, both of these plus some cables and it's $100 which is really nice. And what this allows you to do is to put one of these on a camera and the other one on a flash, either a speed light or a studio strobe like this. And uh, you can use that to trigger your flashes instead of having a sync cable. And so that gives you some freedom. Now these are strictly triggers. So there is no TTL. There's nothing else that these do. All they do is send a signal to make your flash fire. So there's no hypersync or high speed sync or TTL metering, none of that stuff. They're just triggers. And so what these do is this allows you to not only trigger from a standard modern DSLR like this that has a hot shoe that you can use for a flash, but you can even hook these up to old school cameras like this Polaroid as long as it has a PC terminal that allows you to uh, give some kind of trigger to tell the flash to fire. So I'll show you both of these. And again, as I mentioned, you can trigger even a speed light or a studio strobe. So let's look and see how these guys work. And so what you need to do first is to make sure that these are turned on and at the same channel. Now these have 16 channels. So there's a little dial here and it goes from one to 16. And so you just make sure that each of these, the transmitter and the receiver are set to the same channel. And then you turn both of these on. And then to make sure it's on, there's a little button right here that you can click. And if both things are on, you're going to get a little light that shines here. And so you know that this is working the way it should be. If this isn't on, when you click that, nothing's going to happen. Or if this one's not on. So you can really quickly make sure that you have everything set correctly. The right channels are set and it's good to go. So you take this guy and this is the transmitter and it goes right onto the hot shoe of your camera. I'll show you in a second how to mount it to something like this. And then this, it's very simple. You just take a flash and slide it onto the hot shoe right there. And then when you take a picture, that's going to fire. Now this has to all be uh, metered in manual mode. There is no TTL metering. So when you're using this on a speed light, you're going to have to use that in manual mode and then uh, either use a guide number or a flash meter to figure out uh, what to put that flash on. Because there, again, there is no TTL. So when I take this off of here, if I wanted to connect this to, let's say, a studio strobe, well, I could use one of these included cables, and they have a lot of different options here for that. And so I'm going to use this mini uh, jack right here, put it in the sync cable of my Profoto, and then I can put this on the back of the receiver. I don't have a flash attached to this, but it works just the same. So when I uh, trigger this, that would tell the flash pack to fire, and the flash would fire. And so that's a pretty standard uh, configuration, which is really nice. And the other thing that's really nice is, let's say, I'm going to put this back on my speed light. Let's say you want to use these with um, a camera that doesn't have a hot shoe. Well, no problem. I can take this off the hot shoe. I've got my old Polaroid camera here. And what I can do is on the transmitter, there's a small uh, jack right there that I can put this really small uh, connector there. This is an eighth inch pin. And then this has an actual PC terminal which most modern cameras have, but some old cameras do as well. So as long as I plug that in there, now this is going to tell the transmitter to tell the receiver to tell the flash to fire, and so it'll work. So I've got this all hooked up, and now when I click the button, boom, there it goes. So I can do that over and over, and this is going to flash. Works just fine. So it works with older uh, cameras as well as newer cameras, which is really awesome. Now on the bottom of the receiver and on the transmitter, there's a standard quarter 20 thread. And so that allows you to mount those onto a standard uh, a light stand or anything that has a quarter 20 thread like a tripod or something. So you can put your flash uh, somewhere else besides on your camera or on this. And the kit comes with a single little adapter so you can put that on a table like this. And the nice thing is this has a flat bottom to it so it stands up pretty well just on its own without any kind of stand. And so this is a really awesome kit. Now the entire Flashpoint X-Series 2.4 gigahertz remote flash trigger kit that I just showed you, the entire thing is $100 so it's a great bargain. Well, thanks for joining me today here on Adorama TV. Remember, if you have a question about photography gear, you can send your questions to me at askmark at adorama.com. This episode is brought to you by Adorama TV. Visit the Adorama Learning Center where you'll find photography tips and techniques, links to the gear used in this episode, and related videos. For all the latest photography, video, and computer gear, visit adorama.com. And the next time you're in New York City, visit our store located on 18th Street between 5th and 6th Avenue.